Hey, this is Dr. B, and I'd like to give you some brief assistance with Module 2, Lab 2. That is the Powerade Lab. Since it's in Module 2, I'm going to click on right here, which is Module 2. This might look a little different from a student's perspective, but there it is, Module Number 2, and I've got various assignments. Click on that. There's Powerade right there. Uh, that looks like Lab Number 1. There it is, Lab Number 2. And I see, please go to, so I'll go to there. Now I've already logged on, so my login information is right there. So I'm going to go ahead and sign in. And when I do, I see this, and I'm going to enter the course. That's where you can click there. So I'll enter the course, and there's the Powerade lab right there. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that, and here we go. I see lots of things, and a big fat arrow. I think I'll click on the arrow. And then there's a teacher, and I could click on this and listen to them talk. After I do that, I'll go to the next slide. And when I do, it says you have different types of drinks, and you're supposed to drag the, uh, the molecular views that match for the concentrated, medium, and dilute ones. I've already done it, and I got the correct screen. So what I would do at that point is I'd take a picture of it. I like to use the snipping tool for that. So I'd uh, go to a new uh, snipping tool. Oh, and I have the little crosshair, so that's great. So I would just snip it, get a copy of it. There you go. Make sure I'm copying it. And you might use some different program for a screen uh, grabbing tool, but I've got it now. Uh, do I want to save it? Well, hang on. Let's just, I already copied it. So now I'll go to my... Uh, the file that I want to put it in, and for, uh, let's see, for the Powerade, I like these worksheets. I'm going to use these worksheets here, and there it is coming up. Okay, and it asks to give me the screenshots, so I'll do that. I do, uh, oh, but you don't have permission to edit it, so that's not surprising, because otherwise you'd be answering it for everybody. So once I can... I'm going to download it as a copy. It's ready, so I'll download it. Now I have my own personal copy, which I'll open. And I know that some of you were sending me emails saying, I can't seem to edit my PowerPoint. Well, I had to make it so that each person does an individual answer. I'm sure you could understand that. I'll enable some editing. And now finally, I have my own version here, and I'll paste in my picture, make it much smaller. And I think the professor, that's me, will see that green screen if I go about like this. There you go, like that. And maybe I'm going to even bring it to the front just because I'm kind of like that. And now it's right there there. No, you know what? I might send it to the back. You don't have to do this stuff. It just makes it look a little bit better when you do that. Oh, it didn't change it at all. So that's one. I got nine to go and I'll be done with the lab. And that's how you do the Powerade lab just in an outline form. I hope that helps everybody and send me any emails if you have any questions. Thanks.